What's up, everybody? This is Jose with Oakland Latinos United, a.k.a. Oakland Latinos Unidos, on here with a new video, a new spill for you guys to enjoy. What well, a video I'm going to make today is about a YouTuber and um, internet personality who I've been noticing re more recently. Um, I don't know much about this dude, to be really honest with you. I just recently started watching his lives. Um, you know, I, I work for a living driving, so I drive around a lot. So I'm always listening to different podcasts and different things. And sometimes new stuff pops up on my feed and I watch it. And uh, we're going to talk about Norby's, who has a uh, a uh, website or YouTube channel called Run the Fade. And I guess he's from Southern California, somewhere in L.A. or Southern California area. And... I guess he's been kind of making a name for himself on Rhodium Radio's, uh, you know, Tony A show. And, you know, there's been a lot of drama between him and American Cholo and, uh, you know, all that drama between Tony A, American Cholo and uh, Marvelous Inc. And, and, you know, all the stuff that's been happening. He's part of some of that drama. And, um, you know, it's unfortunate that Chicanos are fighting each other on YouTube. When, you know, we should be making money and, and, and coming together and, and breaking barriers. But, you know, a lot of fools revert to dramas and, and and BS. And it's unfortunate, but that's just how it is. You know what I mean? So Norby's is in the camp of um, of um, Rhodium Radio and Marvelous Inc. He doesn't like American Cholo or his camp. And, you know, he was on a live the other day. And he was talking about American Cholo. Um, I guess having Adam Twenty Two on his show now. As we, as I'm making this video, the Adam Twenty Two video with American Cholo drop. I haven't had a chance to hear it. I've been, I've been busy. I'll probably watch it tonight or tomorrow and make a reaction on that as well. That's coming too. And uh, one thing I've seen, I actually seen the live that we're about to talk about, and I seen what Norby's had to say. And, um, I guess Hater World, um, uh, Blue Devil or whatever his name is, Blue Devil, Haters World, made a video where Norby's was saying that black people are monkeys. Now, American Cholo also posted that video on his, uh, I've seen it on his IG, and, um, I know for a fact, because I was watching that live, that that was taken out of context. Now... Again, I don't know Norby's. I don't. I'm not taking his side or American Cholo side. I'm just. I just don't like character assassinations. I don't like lies, and I don't like when people use things like this because that's what creates racial divisions. Because people that want to divide black and brown are going to use this to say, "Look, those Mexicans are racist. They don't like black people." But the lie basically. Norby's was ranting about American Cholo. You got to watch the whole live, and I'm going to leave a link to it for you can see what I'm talking about. He was ranting about American Cholo. He was saying that, um, that you know, that American Cholo sold out and that all his camp sold out to Adam-22 and that WAC-100, who has beef with uh, with American Cholo, uh, is, is friends with Adam-22 and that Adam-22, you know, uses all these guys to start beefs. And basically he said that Adam that blacks and Latinos were Adam 22's little monkeys. I guess you could say like circus monkeys, you know, he's saying like they're little slaves or whatever and he's the master, you know, uh or monkey see monkey do. That's exactly what he said. He said blacks and Latinos were Adam 22's monkeys was what he was saying. And I know what he means. He's saying that they were like his puppets, his lackeys. The Adam-22 was like the puppet master. You couldn't even say the slave master. And um, that's what was said. Not that black people were monkeys or anything like that. He was talking about people who basically act a fool and start dramas on Adam-22's podcast. That He says that blacks and Latinos that go on there acting like buffoons or monkeys to uh, to Adam-22. And there's some truth to that, and I'll, I'll break that down. 
But that's what was said. And you can see it in the video. I'm going to post it, like I said, a link. It's about at the 800 mark. So just go and watch it and you'll see. And basically it was taken out of context and put like Norby said that black people were monkeys. And that's not true. That's not what he said. Now, could he have used better words? Were they insensitive words? Yeah, I could, I could see that. I mean, I know people are more sensitive these days. He could have said lackeys. He could have said clowns. I usually say clowns, clown show. That's, if you see any of my videos, I always say that. Um, you know, he could have said, you know, seals. He could have said uh, um, robots. You know, he could have used a, a lot of words. You know what I mean? He could have said they're slaves. You know, he could have used a lot of different words. Even that one might be insensitive. Or his flunky. You know, a lot of words he could have used. But he said monkeys. That he's... That blacks and Latinos are Adam 22's monkeys. Now, maybe the wording's not good, but I agree with him to a degree. Yes, us people of color, black and brown people who consume hip hop and consume urban music, we have given people like Adam 22 and Black TV the power to be the voice of hip hop and to make or break anyone in hip hop. We gave them that power by supporting them, by watching their videos, by liking their videos, by sharing their videos, you know what I mean? By not calling them out, you know what I mean? Letting them be the culture vultures that they are and exploit black and brown people, especially black people because hip hop is a black art form, but there's Chicanos and Latinos and Raza in it as well. So he is right on that, that a lot of people are Adam 22 and even black TVs flunkies or, um, you know what I mean? Or robots or, uh, or clowns. You know what I mean? To me, it's all a clown show. You know, and these guys have a history like these, these platforms like Vlad and, and Adam 22 of, of, you know, having people acting a fool, acting buffoonish, like clowns, clown show. He's had a history of, of having people incriminating themselves, them, them, them platforms of incriminating themselves and stuff like that. So I get what he's saying. He was basically saying that American Cholo sold out to Adam-22 and that a lot of Latinos and blacks on Adam-22's No Jump were sold out, that they're his monkeys. That's what he said. Now, the, the words he used were probably insensitive and maybe he could have used better wording, but that's what he said. And you can see the video. I'm going to leave a link for yourself. So, no, I don't. He wasn't being racist against black people, saying black people are monkeys. That's that's completely ridiculous. You know what I mean? And um, I'm not coming to defense of anybody. I'm just setting the record straight. Because American Cholo, was they did the same thing to him. Adam-22 did that, where he put out a video where it made American Cholo look like he was saying the N-word. Saying that black people are the N-word, and that's not what he was saying. American Cholo was saying that, that a friend of his got out of jail and was using the N-word, and it bothered him. It, America, it bothered American Cholo, and he was telling that story, and they took it out of context. Same thing with Norby's. They took this video out of context, saying that he called black people monkeys. So, American Cholo, man, you shouldn't be posting stuff like that that's out of context, especially when Adam-22 did it to you. Now, American Cholo being on Adam-22's channel, you know what I mean, um... I don't have much to say about that because I haven't seen the video. I'm going to watch the video. Like I said, it came out today. I'm going to watch it either tonight or tomorrow, and I'll make a reaction soon. That's coming this week. Bus show. And um, you know what I mean? I just wanted to set the record straight. It's not about Norby's. I don't know Norby's. I don't have no reason to protect him. I'm not on his side. But I don't like character assassination and lies and people taking people out of context. Because that make, that could make all of us look bad at the end. I'm talking about all Rasa. No matter if North or South. Just Rasa in general. You feel me? And that's all I have to say. Again, give me a link to the video. Look, look at the 900 mark. You know, whether you agree with Norby's or not, that's not the point. The point is what he said. Look at the video and you judge for yourself. Leave it in the comment. That's all I have to say. This is Oakland Latinos United over and out.